Hey everybody, this is Barry and I come back to you guys with another House Redwine Kings of the Arbor. And this is the last time I'm going to be trying to do this video, because I've done this two or three times already and it's it's getting annoying. <laughs> Anyways, just want to say I will be taking the advice of one of your people. I'm sorry, I forgot your name, but... I'm uh, going to be using your idea and just dropping a couple men off at Salt Shore and distracting their units of Martell men. We'll probably just kill off Martell first since it's really easy to board and dis... Uh, dis... what I'm, I'm thinking pretty much disengage or just put... take men off ships, basically. It's coastal and it's susceptible to Navy attacks, or naval attacks, and yes, we're going to completely cash in on that. With that possible, we should crush them. Alright, so. The history with this battle is that I won it, I lost about a third of the men, and I completely annihilated the Martells, but the game crashed, so I had to restart and redo the whole thing. And... Then, after that, I had a completely crushing defeat. I lost 90% of my men, and the king died, so I couldn't really accept that, because we lost the campaign, so, uh, no. So, since I won and lost once, this is going to be the tiebreaker. Since, if we would have kept the, kept the win, then, I mean, there's no point in... There's no point in pointing fingers at me saying that you got defeated. It's like, I didn't get defeated. I, I'm just going to do this one way this time. Alright, everybody, get over here, out in the open. That way I can see everything. Now run. Good deal, good deal. Now, we'll slow it down a little bit. <clears throat> and we will actually try and set up our units. The last two times I set up on the hill, and now I just want a clear opening. Well, this could go badly. Yep, this can go badly. Yep, this is gonna go very badly. Yep, yep, yep. <clears throat> and we'll fight to the death. Fight to the death. Fight to the death. Fuck you all. Fight to the death. Alright, fight to the death, guys. Alright, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Bring it on, Beatrice. You won't be beating us down today. We have cut off the serpent's head. The enemy general is slain. Really? Let's see how these snakes fight. <laughs> that was pretty damn head. quick. Last time, uh, the last two times, it took at least halfway through the battle where they lost half their men before any general died. And I mean, we killed their generals all the time, but before anything happened, really. Alright, so we're going to be saving these guys, and we're going to have these guys out ready. We're just going to march in there and take them down. Save those guys, and then we'll use these outriders, actually. Because I imagine those desert archers will pick us off pretty amusingly. Oh, they, they're so annoying, it's not even funny. I mean, they'll. When it's getting close to the end of the battle, both times, 
or last the last two times, they would just shoot at the general general's unit, you know, just to piss me off a little bit. And now the death toll will be catastrophic. The death toll is catastrophic. You must contact me. You must contact me. Are you kidding me? What the fudge? Ugh. Die, motherfuckers. Yes, I will swear. It is pissing me the hell off that nothing is happening in my favor right now. I mean, I just can't take it. I just cannot take it right now. It's just too much. Alright, you two. Have fun. Fire at will. Alright, and with that, I bid you adieu. Alright, so if we can get at those archers, that would make me so happy right now. Units, move out. But yeah, our archers are left out in the open, so I will put those levies over there as their defense, we'll say. Well, we killed maybe 10 of these guys. Uh, yep. Yep, he's routed. Damn. Alright, well, the first unit to route is never the first unit to fa- uh, stop, shut up. Whatever. Alright, so, we'll actually use these guys. Get in there and fight, men. Hit the damn thing right. Kill those bodyguard and just get rid of them. All because they have so much cavalry, it's just. Oh, I just need to breathe. I just need to breathe. breathe. There we go. Alright, well this is looking good. Okay. I think the second battle must have been because I didn't cash on or cash in on when uh, men their men would break. I didn't send my cavalry after them and try to kill them off. Which probably ended up having us lose the battle because we didn't do that, so Alright, so we'll kill those guys off. Go forward. Move forward. Kill off those motherfudges. Alright, and then go kill those guys. Where are my reinforcements? And one guy got away. That is something special. Look at that. Look, just look at it. Just look at it. Enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their Yeah, we're gonna capture your guys. Cause my guy is awesome. I bet those guys are gonna cut him down, but I don't really care. Oh shit. Oh, oh. Get get more guys. Kill kill these guys quick. Fighting! Fight them all! Fight them down! Kill them! Kill them all! Ah! Death, destruction, stuff! All 
right? So, with that, I bid you all adieu. No, I'm just kidding. Anyways, we've lost 25% of our men, and they've almost lost half their men, so... These Sun Spear guards just don't freaking budge. Oh, I just need to breathe air. More oxygen is good for the brain. And I don't like how the cavalry is just glitching out and saying, oh, we can't capture these guys because reasons. Battle appears to be running in our favor. From good tidings such as these, does victory <laughs> spring forth? From good tidings such as these, who needs anemones? And I believe this is going to be where the archers come in to shoot the shit out of us. So I'm going to send men over that way. Actually, don't go too quick. I do need... I do need a lot of these people captured, so... Whoa, whoa, what? I was gonna say, when did we get the castle? I thought we thought we got the castle for a second there. Now, who the hell is shooting at us now? Really? These guys have some damn wicked range. It's so fucking annoying. <sighs> breathe, breathe, Barry, breathe. No, I don't want to breathe. It's too much work. Especially when I'm killing so many of their soldiers right here. Four fights with horns made of clay. We are winning the battle. Yeah, I knew those guys were coming because uh, reasons, reinforcements are a bitch. And yeah, I didn't want them to be this time, so I want to kill them off, quick. And yes, now is the time to kill these guys off and finally get rid of them. Oh, sh stuff. Oh, did you hear that? Never heard that before, and I've been playing this game quite a long time. Us like a herd of goats. Drive them from the battle. Oh, watch this! Watch this! This will make all the pain and suffering worth it. Lances down, boys, and splash show. Splash down. Four, three, two, one, and. Oh, there's still still enough still enough for them, so we'll make it none. All right, so these guys both routed, which is nice. This group of ten knights is kind of being. Douche, douches to us. Douchiest. They will be douches. The archers came back, which are annoying as hell. And we've only lost 27% of our men. Which is spectacular. Just die. Die, you screw. Screw you all. Screw you all. The enemy oh my gosh, just they they give up. Fight. Please. The enemy general flees like an old woman. Attack and break the will of his men. And yeah, we broke the will of like everybody on this battlefield. It's not even a question now. I mean, I would totally just reap what I've sown on this battlefield, but I won't. Yet. Where's those? There's these knights. Okay. Quickly. 
Yeah, we need to get those guys killed off so we don't have to worry about them. Yep, get rid of those done fools. Okay, get rid of those archers. And once those archers are gone, then we'll be super happy and stuff. And yeah. <sighs> happy, happy, joy, joy, happy, happy, joy. Victory is well within our grasp. Yeah, kill him. Time our foe will surely see this and Whatever. lose heart. Okay. Spearmen will fall. Alright, good They're deal, like good deal. We got it. Scour them from the field. We are winning the battle. Oh, I think they're gonna make it before we can get there, so we'll just have the knights run off in the distance so they don't get shot. And then we'll have those guys come down there. What's left of our crossbowmen will come down there. I will say this was a messy battle, but it's a lot better than the first... Well, it's a little bit better than the first one was. Since I knew the archers were coming this time, and plus 1% better. We are winning the battle! Anyways, get back there. And then you guys will be in a group, because then I'll have these two guys just full out bull rush everybody. When they decide to come out and play, we will attack and play, in a sense. Oh, come on. Babies, get back. Get back here. Alright, we're going in for the kill now. Going in for the kill now. I don't repeat myself often. But if I have to, I will become mad. Charge! Run through them! Four fights with horns made of clay. We are winning the battle! Behold our worthless foe! See how that general turns tail and flees like a whipped dog. Yep. It's totally a whipped dog, man. Oh shit, 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 shit. Jesus. Hey, hey, get in there, get in there. Ryan might die from this shit. Man, they're really good at defending that door. <laughs> oh god. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Oh that was a good that was a good defense. Give us the give us the gate, dogs. See how that general turns tail and flees like a whipped dog. Yep. The cowardly enemy general has been captured while running away. Guard him. For the present, let us show him we are civilized men. Alright, Brian's gonna stay out of this last bit because yeah, he almost took a turn for the worst there. <laughs> yeah, we lost a couple at the gate. What happened? Well, they pulled out the boiling oil, so, you know. The cooking oil, right? Y yeah, yeah, that, that's that's the oil I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. Ill news comes unlooked for. The enemy have taken our walls. Okay, so the heavy cavalry is trying to pull back. Perhaps we will get to attack them. Yes, we can attack them, that's good. Alright, so they're gonna flee and run after these guys. Yeah, look at that. They barely got one of us. Oh, they got some of us that time. Ouch. Bam! enemy must curse the day they were born. Let all the poets write of this most wondrous triumph. Alright, so 
we've lost only 28% in the end, which is about, I want to say, 1% better when we healed last time. But we've lost no units of cavalry except for the desert knights, and that's all we've lost. I thought we lost those uh, other light cavalry we, that we had, but maybe I pulled them back, I don't know. But yes, we've lost maybe 10 guys less than last time. The first time, but we got a heroic victory this time, and Ulrich, Prince of Sunspear, is finally dead. And will stay dead. Forever. The king eats, and the hand takes the shit. <sighs> the thing is, about losing the battle, I couldn't lose it and have uh, the next guy in line ready. We have prevailed. Because he's, I believe he's 13, so, yeah, exactly. Garrett Redwine. Yes. See, he's he's ready. He's the Prince of the Arbor, but he just couldn't become, uh, you know, he just couldn't be that quick. You know, he couldn't just blame. I'm, I'm ready. I'm the King of the Arbor. So, Garrett is going to stay over here, because it's safe. And, yeah, I'm not even going to... Okay, maybe I should. Maybe I should just be like, you know what, let's just go all out. Can I be... Can I be picky now? I can I can be picky now, can't I? Got two generals and two sons on the way, right? Of course I can. Yes, I think I think it's time I've been picky. And I don't think I'll ever become... Uh, Yes, Sultan. Able to get over in this damn area because it's just so difficult. So, we'll just keep going up north. Since House of Mud's being total douchebags. Anyways, with that ready to go, we got 4,000 in the bank. These idiots think they can beat us. And we crush them easily. Wait, 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 there's a princess over there. How old are you, honey? Yeah, you're too old, sorry. We don't take anybody above 25. Usually. Usually, I... I'll give it a chance here and there. Usually. Alright. Now that we're good there... Get some more units, and we are kind of broke. Oh my gosh. Promising attack. Uh, dysfunctional. This man has times when his madness prevents him. Yeah. I know. He's just mad that he's completely the last guy. <laughs> the last man alive in the, in the line of red wine. But no longer is he the last. Yes, noble master. Hmm. Tomorrow's journey awaits. Orders. Really? How may I serve, Sultan? So I can't get any of these guys to go farther. How may I serve, Sultan? Sultan. Oh, that's good. Get those guys and those guys, and also we'll keep those guys just in case. For some reason we need them. I don't. I don't see any reason why we'd need them, but. Well, there you go. Ooh, there's Tysain Mud. Comes from Martel. He's dead, so that's okay. Greetings, Your Highness. She's 18, but she's a bar wench, basically. Nope. As my Sultan wills. All right. So they got quite a few forces in the area. We will meet you there. But they've got the faction leader and. A Franklin Sand. A Dane. A Dane. A Dane. We will engage them honorably. Get we some crossbowmen. That's good. Has the time come to strike, mighty Sultan? All right, kill these guys off. Theodore, no, thank you. 
Yeah, look at all these famous battle sites. Oh, there's is there not one next to this? That was a heroic battle. Come on. Heroic battle. Heroic battle. Heroic battle. Alright. Some more of those guys recruiting. Still can't use those places for some damn reason. Alright. With a good deal of troops being recruited in the Red Wine capitals, we will be able to crush the resistance once and for all. Once we finish getting it ready. Okay. Alright, we're just gonna assault this sucker. Clear victory. Crush you. Screw you. Yep, I don't care. 12,000. Did you see that? 12,000. And these. I wish I had an assassin to kill that one and wait for that one to die or something. Alright, so we'll kill these guys. Hopefully. Two. Maybe? Yep, okay. Wasn't sure. Never know if you can do something like that. Alright. So, Brian's on the move. And we need him to have a little bit of a, a bodyguard in a sense. The new Prince of Sunspear is out in the open. Why don't we go kill him? Alright, so that is going to be what Brian's going to work with for now. Take those guys. Take those guys. Take those guys. Eat those guys. And we're moving out. It's almost... Garrett's almost got a full stack with him. And of course they'd lay siege to us, but with Brian on the way back, we'll be able to cut them off and kill them all. No. Screw House Bracken. Yes, noble master. Yes, Sultan. We close for um, battle. Well, wait for a second there. Massey, that's good. Sky reach. Yep, we finally reached for the sky and then they wanted it back. Zaida, mighty Sultan. Yes, Sultan. No. -uh. We're gonna see if the stocks are ready to be friends. Resting here, mighty Sultan. Since, yeah. Orders. Why are you addressing me? Royce Navy. I don't like them, so. Orders, mighty Sultan. I'll we'll join up. I will defeat you honorably, my worthy foe. Yeah, wasn't this guy? Uh, I think he was yes, with the. Uh, like some now we must one of the, one of the other Inshallah, groups, some, the something like that. Oh. Noble one. But yeah, this will be where we end the episode. We'll fight these guys off next time. And also, I did want to say thank you all for making the channel up to 155 subscribers as of now. It means a lot that you guys support me and help me out, and just just watch and let me know what you think that. It means a whole lot, you guys, and I can't tell you enough, and I don't tell you enough, and I should tell you more, but I will be telling you more in the future. Anyways, thank you all for watching, have a lovely day, and enjoy the rest of your week with more videos. Ha ha ha, Baronite out.